Hey folks, I'm John P, and today on GeekBeat, we're taking a look at an amazing piece of British engineering. And no, it's not an Aston Martin. Welcome back to my home theater, folks. Now, the last time we were here, I was showing you the amazing Martin Loken surround system. Today, we're taking a look at the KEF T205 system, which includes a five-speaker setup plus a powered subwoofer. The only reason I even mention the Martin Logan system is because I want to start off with a story. You see, I got these KEFs before I sent back the Martin Logans, and at first I installed them downstairs in our living room. They replaced a Polk audio set, and I'm not kidding, I couldn't believe the difference it made. It was crazy. So, we were having a movie night at the house, and a bunch of people came over to hear the Martin Logans. What they didn't know is that I had set up the KEF T-Series speakers right beside the Martin Logans, and I started the movie without telling them. For a few minutes, out of eight people in the room, there were no comments. Then one person said, wait, are those the Martin Logans we're listening to? That's how good these tiny little T-Series KEFs are. I almost got away with passing them off as $5,000 set of electrostatic speakers. So let's talk about why that's so amazing, starting with the price. You can get a set of these T205s on Amazon right now for $2,000. Now really, they aren't as good as the Big Daddy Martin Logans for 250% the price, but amazingly, I'd say they're at least 90% as good, which takes us to point number two, they're like one quarter the size. The KEFs are designed to mount directly on the wall as a fantastic complement to any flat screen TV. You'll notice nice attention to detail, like the fact that the center channel has the KEF logo on one end, while the mains have them on the bottom. You're also going to notice that these speakers are ridiculously thin and light. I mean, seriously, they should not sound this good. But they do, because the crazy engineers over in the UK just had to invent these ultra-low profile drivers that are only a couple of inches deep. Normally, a speaker this thin sounds really, well, let's face it, like sh**. But I asked my friend Dippin over at KEF what the secret was, and he told me. Oh, I'm not telling you. I just want you to know that I know, and it's awesome. Anyway, moving on, KEF uses these really thin speakers that sound amazing to build these beautiful cabinets, and then they combine them with the T2 subwoofer. The T2 is a powered subwoofer with a built-in 250-watt Class D amp. It weighs 28.6 pounds, and you can get it in any color, as long as you want black. I love three things about this subwoofer. It's tight and powerful, so listening to it's a real pleasure. It's very compact, so you can hide it just about anywhere in the room. But it's also drop-dead gorgeous, so why would you want to? Now, after all that gushing, I've got to give you the bad news. First, I do not like the way they did the speaker wire posts at all. You have to use tiny little hex keys to tighten up your speaker wire. And what I really want are banana post connectors so I can use some high quality wires. Secondly, the wall mounting plates that came with these speakers are amazingly simple. You mount the plates to the wall and then you just hang the speakers on them. Really, really easy for many installations. But if you need to mount them in any other way, like suspending them from a ceiling, you're going to have to literally fabricate custom mounts because they just don't offer any other options. Now, as much as those two things really bother me, these speakers sound so good, I just can't stay mad at Kef. In fact, I've never heard anything this small that sounded this good at any price. So we're awarding the T205 series a Geek Beat Editor's Choice Award, and we're also awarding the Kef T2 Subwoofer an Editor's Choice Award all on its own, because for $700, you can add this little box of awesome to whatever system you have. So that's it for this review. Stay tuned to Geek Beat for more news and reviews, and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel at youtube.com forward slash geekbeattv. Take care.